But we start tonight with the developing story. New police body cam video showing us one of the last conversations that a California woman had before she disappeared here in Arizona. That is where we start this Saturday night here on 12 News at 10 o'clock. Thanks so much for joining us. I'm Jonathan McCall. 32 year old Chelsea Grimm was seen in Williams just west of Flagstaff back on September 30th. 12 News journalist Jade Cunningham just finished watching that body cam video frame by frame and shows us what Grimm told officers. Hello. Hello. How are you doing? I'm okay. How are you? The interaction lasts about seven and a half minutes. I'm doing great. Are you doing all right? Yeah. And shows 32 year old Chelsea Grimm just a few days before reportedly disappearing. I just was doing a photo shoot of the lost soldiers and got a little emotional. So I'm so I was crying before okay. I got back on the road. The body cam footage from September 28th was taken by Williams police who responded to a call of suspicious activity at the Williams Cemetery. Oh, I'm sorry. No, no, you're quite all right. I mean, this... I was just doing a photo shoot. Yeah. At one point, the officer asks her if she has a hotel to stay at, and she says she didn't. I don't. I was actually thinking of just camping for the night, but I wasn't really sure exactly yet. Gotcha. Well, I didn't you... plan to be here till sunset. Okay. According to family, Grimm was driving from San Diego to Connecticut for a wedding, but in Arizona, she told them she wouldn't make it and was going camping instead. That was the last they heard from her and reported her missing October 4th. I was contacted by the Coconino Sheriff's Department on the 5th that some hunters had found her car with two flat tires and she was not in it. The car was locked and they hadn't they couldn't find any trace of Chelsea at that point. Her 2019 white Ford Escape was found north from where the traffic stop happened a week earlier. Grimm's wallet, some clothes, a sleeping bag and her pet bearded dragon Rosie were also gone. Coconina Sheriff Jim Driscoll says foul play is possible. It's, it's certainly a possibility. Um, we, you know, we, we focus on both the, the person is potentially lost or, or that there is foul play. Just hang out here however long you want. Um, and you're good to go. Awesome. In the footage, the officer tells Grimm where a safe spot to rest is. You got it. Appreciate your compassion. And walks away. You. Yeah, you got it. Have a great rest of your day. And as authorities now investigate her disappearance, her family hanging on to hope, this conversation won't be her last. Jay Cunningham, 12 News. Jade, thank you. Investigators say two days after that conversation with police, a woodcutter told them that he talked with Grimm where her car was later found. He said that she told him that she did not need any help and that she was out taking pictures. Anyone with information on the case now urged to call the Coconino County Sheriff's Office.